Hello everyone and welcome back to on our channel. My name is Enes and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop in below or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment and also each message on my Instagram because simply I'm working for you. And today I'm going to show you if it's possible drop shipping with no money. Is it a fairy tale? No, fairy tales are in Disney. This is on our channel. Make sure to subscribe. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to actually do drop shipping with no money. Because mostly people say, well, dropshipping, you need a lot of money. Well, if you have a lot of money, you don't need to do dropshipping. You already have a lot of money. <laughs> so that, that's my point here. You can start actually dropshipping with little money or no money at all. And I'm, I'm not going to talk here and blah, 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 and say how to do it or whatever the case is. I'm going to show you actually people who actually run a store and generate sales with free traffic without having a big budget to run a bunch of ads and all of that to generate sales i'm going to show you some stores that are generating sales by free traffic and i'm not saying that these stores are actually generating 100 percent free sales no that's not the case they may have after they get some sales they may have started some ads and all of that to to generate more sales basically so i'm going to show you the stores and show you also how many visitors they get each month and where those visitors are coming from and also I'm going to explain how they do it and what you should learn in order to do it or where you should start in order to do it and I do have three stores for this example two are clothing stores and one for gadgets and electronics and all of that and they are all Shopify stores and I will prove it to you first before we check their stats and visitors and where they're coming from and all of that so please if you got some value from this video make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel please i'm trying to get to 20,000 by the end of the year uh, i don't think i can make it but with your help definitely i can so thank you if you did that and without any more talking let's just jump to the screen so as i said this is my channel make sure to subscribe there is a red button right here that says subscribe i don't know if it's red anymore or blue or what is the case here but please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you think you can get some value free here and also the trick i will show or the trick that i'm going to talk about i'm going to make more videos about it in depth because it needs a lot of explaining not just one video this trick needs more explaining and also more details on how to do it properly and succeed in it and without any more talking let's just get to it so let's just close here and this is the first website as you can see it's called tooth savvy tooth savvy or Tate Savy, I don't know how you can pronounce that. I'm sorry, English is my, not my native uh, language, so I do struggle with using words and stuff, so bear with me, please. So as you can see, this is a Shopify store. You can just tell with the icon and tell with the layout of the, of the store. You can tell it's Shopify, but I'm gonna prove it to you. So if we scroll down all the way button, you can see it says powered by Shopify. So as you can see, this is a Shopify store, and this store actually generates most of it says from the search engine people search for products and they end up on this store and they buy from it without having to run any ads i'm not sure right now if they do run ads or not i'm going to check later but most of their sales they came from the from the free traffic which is sau so i'm going to prove that let's just copy the link for the website right here and head over to similar web which is a platform with it will show you the a website or an application the traffic it gets or where it get it gets it from and all of that so let's just pass the website here come on click come on i can't click on it for some reason let's just reload the page this way this page is not responsible okay here we go so let's just paste the website here and hit enter okay if we scroll down it will give you a bunch of information here as you can see total visits it's 11,000 and if we scroll down 11,000 this month and it's growing as you can see just just two months ago it was half the visitors it gets from 6,000 or 5.9 exactly to 11.6 so let's just scroll down as you can see the views are coming from the United States Portugal Australia Philippines and Canada and mostly search traffic it's first world countries from my experience i did i did work a lot on sau i do have some websites in sau and i do generate some revenue from them so mostly the search traffic uh, in this case if you are working in english 
If you are working in English, most of the search traffic comes from first world countries, from my experience. So let's just scroll down here. Other uh, visit websites, Google. So we are looking for the, here we go, the, ma the marketing channel distribution. So where the traffic is coming from to this website. As you can see, 16% from direct, 0.0% from referrals, and 70% from search. So 70% are from search. And you might say, well, they run ads on the search. If they run ads on the search, you will find the percentage here in display. This is the part where they calculate the, the, the ads, basically. The views that are coming from ads or the visitors that are coming from ads. So 70% of the views are coming from the search. And I'm going to show you on examples of the keywords, what people are searching for on how they end up on this website. So as I said, 70% from the search and 6.9% from the social. Maybe they run some, some ads right now from the social and 0.01 from the mail and 6% from display. So let's just scroll down and here is the keywords. This is the top keywords that's driving traffic for the website. So as you can see, it says here diaper bag divider, diaper bag divider, as you can see. I don't know, is this a product or what, what is this? Diaper bag divider. Maybe, <laughs> I have no idea. So this is the name for the website, obviously. And this is beach bag organizer or orgazers, orgazers, beach bag orgazers. This is, looks like some products or something like that. Let's just search with Google to see for ourselves, of course. We like to, to sneak. Okay, this is a transparent bag for them. Mm -hmm. Looks like some special bags for a special purpose. This is a purse organizer with laptop sleeves. Search this again. Yeah, this is a product again. So people are searching for this product and they end up on the website and they buy it. And how much money it cost them? Zero. Yes, zero dollars. Yeah, this is a bag with the purse on it. This is not practical for me. This is good. I think this is a good product, but this one is not practical for me. Where I come from, if you put your bag or your wallet in here, it's gone. <laughs> there is no question about it. If you put your wallet here and you go outside right now where I live, it's gone. So let's just get back here. Also the title and 86 other keywords that's driving traffic to this website. We can see them, we need to pay for a, for similar way. They have a, a premium plan where you can see all the, the keywords and stuff. I will make a video uh, tutorial on the premium plan here on the similar web because it's really good for people that are interested in this topic. So where is it? Where is it? Here is the keywords here and that's it. As you can see, visitors to their products and making sales without having to pay for ads and all of that. They mostly do it with SAO, which stands for search engine optimization. And also you may be wondering how they rank their products for the search engine. They make blogs for their products. They make blogs with keywords that are searchable or what people are searching for in the criteria, which is bags in this case we, we saw. So they make blogs for the best bags for beaches the best bags for the school, the best bags for work and all of that. So they make keywords that are people already searching for and they list their products. So people end up on the website, they see the information, they know the information and they buy from the website because it's, it's convenience. Uh, you already found the information and also the bag that you're looking for on the website, so you're gonna buy it. So this is the first website right here. And the second website right here, it's called Loom footwear. So they make shoes, these guys right here. They make a really awesome shoes, by the way. I, I like their shoes. I just check them out and I, I do like them. So as you can see, you can say for, you can tell from the message here, this is uh, Shopify. Also from the icon here, you just scroll down. Area is powered by Shopify, as you can see. So even though if the website owner did hit this part of uh, powered by Shopify, you can discover if the website is running on Shopify or not. You can just right click, inspect element, and you see a bunch of resources here. Let's just scroll down a little bit. Here it is. As you can see, it says here, cdn.shopify.com. 
you can't hit this even if you are a programmer or hacker whatever you are and you're trying to hit all the information about Shopify from the website you can't hit this because if you did hit this or remove this link your website will not work this is called content delivery network for Shopify this is where Shopify uh, loads data on the websites or the stores that's running Shopify so this is the link of their uh, content delivery network so as you can see this is a Shopify website that's selling shoes and all of that and yes they do drive traffic from the search engine let's just copy their username uh, their website sorry let's just go to similar web again let's just paste it in here and hit search and here we go let's just scroll down and the total views here are 146,000 views which is a lot to be honest a lot and if we scroll down here you can see they are going up with search engine optimization you're always going up you're always going up as you can see one, uh, 131k uh, 119 this is some update from Google because it does happen when you have a, uh, an SEO website or a blog when uh, Google doesn't update or something like that you your website might go down or eventually will go up again so as you can see here 146,000 views in August let's just scroll down and again the top countries here United States Canada United Kingdom Australia Indonesia and others as I said SAU if you're working on English you will get uh, first world countries mostly so let's just scroll down to the part where we need here we go again <laughs> so this website right here marketing channel distribution where the views are coming for the website as you can see 80% direct 0.5% referrals Refers which is the websites that are uh, have links to this website and thirdly search engine which is 73 percent and search traffic all for free and check the social one percent <laughs> and display 0.0 percent so they barely run ads and they generate sales you can't tell me 146,000 views without sales that's not possible but they do invest a lot in making blogs because SEO takes hard work. And I'm going to explain this after I show you the websites. After I show you the websites, I'm going to explain some key points on also one, of more, one more important point, which is when, if it's free, how you can run Shopify for a couple of months running SEO and paying for the monthly fee. Yes, you're right. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna spend a lot of money on Shopify plans and you still didn't get some traffic because SAU takes time but I have an idea for you I will show you how to do that without having to pay for Shopify so let's just scroll down for the keywords again here we go again waterproof sneakers waterproof shoes this is the keyword for them the loom footwear how to whiten shoes so this is a keyword that people searching for how to whiten shoes it has nothing to do with the brand you can't see any keyword here from the brand this has nothing to do with the brand this is a keyword that are people searching for they do discover it in keyword planner or whatever keyword tool they use in and they make a blog targeting this keyword right here which is how to wait on a shoes and they list their products in their article which is clever idea basically which is really clever idea how to store shoes so <laughs> this also has nothing to do with their brand how to store shoes and they drive traffic from this and they generate sales without having to pay for ads which is amazingly clever as you can see a bunch of keywords here 498 keywords as i said they barely run ads they, they are mostly focused on seo because it's the jackpot if you can get yeah check the <laughs> check the views here organic with pays 92 percent are organic and seven percent are paid i don't know where the seven percent comes maybe from the search as well from the ads and search but 92 percent are organic and completely free. not completely free they do pay writers and all of that to write the content and all of that it takes a lot of time but if you want to do it you can do it without having to pay for content writers to write you only have to have the hustle and the heart and the time and the effort and to invest in the sao website or a blog or shopify store in this case so as you can see 400 keywords and they are all has nothing to do with the branded sales they drive traffic to them and they make sales for free so the last website here 
as I said, for gadgets. This is called Gadgets Discovery Club. This is a little bit different because they, they, they have a, it's a type of store or type of uh, website where you make a quiz, you ask, you answer a bunch of questions or based on their questions, you get a gift or a gadget to discover or to buy, basically. Which is a really clever idea, actually. I've seen this before and it's really working well in some areas. Not every people will fall for this or will, will buy some stuff from you, but some people will definitely do. So let's just copy the URL for the website, which is gadgetdiscoveryclub.com and let's hit back again to our friend, which is similar way, and hit enter and wait for it. Please hurry up. People are listening here. People are waiting. Hurry up, man. All right. Okay, 118,000 views. Let's scroll down. Yeah, it seems like it's going down for some reason. As I said, this is some probably some uh, some Google update in here. That's why it did go down, but eventually they will go up again. Just scroll down. And again, as I said, search traffic is always from the first world countries, United Kingdom, United States, Germany, Ireland, Australia, and others. So let's just go to the part and here we go. This website does not make a full go at SAO or make a full investment on SAO. They do have some little bit of uh, each part. For example, 80% direct, 29% referrals and 30%, 35% sorry from the search. And also they do have some display here, as you can see, some display 11%. So, but definitely the bigger percentage is search, search traffic 35%. Let's just scroll down to the keywords. So for this website, it seems like I didn't do my research right. This is, <laughs> the, it looks like they, 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 they are already known. So they have a lot of LinkedIn websites, obviously. So when you, they have the referrals, they make guest posts. They are called guest posts. So they make guest posts on other blogs and big websites. So they drive traffic through that. And also people, when they read about them on the other blogs and big websites, they Google them to check if they are legit and all of that. So that's why most of the big keywords here, the first keywords are their names, which is basically uh, Gadgets Discovery Club. Uh, this is just gadgets. This is a typo with D. That's why they are ranked here because they have the D here in discovery. <laughs> this is a weird case here. So uh, uh, as well, Gadgets Discovery Club trial box is Gadgets Discovery Club free the first time pop in a box. I don't know what this is called. Anyway, so as you can see, this is definitely possible. This is definitely possible. And the question you might have in mind, as I said, well, how can I do it if you don't have money? How can I buy a Shopify plan for a bunch of months to, uh, to generate traffic to search? Well, you can actually sign up for a partner program. The partner program on Shopify, you can actually run the store on all of that, but you can't make sales or there is, I think, a limited number of sales per day. Or I think you can't make sales, I think. Yeah, you can't make sales on a partner program. But however, you can start writing blogs. You can start writing blogs, targeting keywords and all of that. Once you start getting some traffic from the search by targeting those keywords and all of that, then you can switch to the paid plan on Shopify. Then you can get some sales by those keywords. So the first couple of months, you only need to sign up for the partner program. You don't have to pay any fee or any monthly plan or something like that. And invest heavily your time, I said your time, invest heavily your time in writing blogs, targeting keywords. And if you are interested in that, make sure to subscribe because I will make more videos about SAO on how to write blogs and how to target keywords and mostly how to stuff keywords in your articles or blogs and how to use them properly. Because if you spam them in, in your uh, article or blog, uh, Google will know that basically. Google is, 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 is a genius giant IA robot. <laughs> so he will definitely know, know that. So make sure to subscribe if you are interested in that. I will, I will make more videos in depth about SAO because I do have some websites, as I said, and SAO, and I do have a website that made over $9,000 uh, a year, a year, not a month. Uh, I, would not, I wouldn't lie and say in a month, no, I uh, made 
uh, dollars in a year from SEO, which is the best part about this is completely profit. That's all profit. I think it's seven between seven hundred and eight and eight hundred dollars each month from the SEO. And I didn't work the full year. All the year I didn't do anything. The website it's passive. The SEO is one hundred percent passive. You will definitely make if you want, once you start getting some views and visits, you will keep getting views for years to come. So that website still generating money, but not as the last year. The last year was like. A, as I said, $700, $800 each month and without having to do anything. I don't even work, as if I just check the revenue. <laughs> I wake up in the morning and I check the revenue for the website, how much it did make yesterday, how much it did make today and all of that. So as I said, if you are interested, make sure to subscribe and if you have any more questions, just drop them below or check out my Instagram right here below me. And thanks so much for watching and I catch you in the next one.